it seems as though everybody that Lolo has won the power of veto. I know I'm a little bit a few hours late, but I saw that first thing this morning. So I don't know what the outcome's gonna be. Will she use the veto? Will she take Dina off the block and send out and send Candy packing? Or will she let the nom stay the same and just let it unfold where she's gonna vote out Candy and Tamar is gonna vote out Dina and then Ricky's gonna have to be the deciding vote. So I wonder because Lolo and Ricky were having a discussion about you know the var- the different variables and ultimately Ricky said no matter what you do Lolo um, you have to do what's best for you because if you vote out Candy Tamar's still gonna be mad and you can't really control what Tamar's gonna do because whereas if Tamar doesn't like something she's gonna be mad about it so you can't control it so to me because I wanted I want Candy to go far, and I don't want Lolo to win, so I'm biased. I think her best thing to do is leave it the same, so she won't get any blood on her hands, and that's good jewelry management, too. However, I have a problem with Dina Lohan getting anywhere close to the final four. First of all, Dina Lohan didn't even realize she was playing the game up until maybe a week ago, and she's still not playing the game. She's just kind of been in the house, kind of there. Like, they'll say, well, we're doing this. She's like, huh, huh, what, what, what's that? Like, Dina isn't playing, and, like, I I would love to see her in the final two. Like, um, well, Dina, what big moves did you make? Moves? Uh, what, what moves? Like, what, what are you talking about moves? Like, Dina is, is not in the game. She's just been there. Like, she's basically been on vacation for the past month in the house. So what scenario do you want to see play out on tonight's episode? Because I just want to see Candy go far. And I know this sounds racist, not racist, but biased. I just kind of want to see all four black people. Although, you know, people are so funny. People are just now realizing that Lolo is biracial. So, you know, she's black, but people still don't know that. But I bet, it, and I just don't want her to win, but I see her winning. I actually see either Ricky or Lolo winning. But I would like to see Candy winning because Candy has played, although some say a lazy game, I think Candy is the one who's been the most strategic out of everybody. Like she said in her interest, in, entrance interview that, you know, her after watching the show, it seems as though you need to lay low and, you know, align with certain people like I feel like Candy has played a good game because I think she strategically gets it like she's the one who's been calling some shots like she she was responsible for some of Tom's moves and she she's the one who like says to Tamar whoa calm down you know like keep a cool head so I really think Candy should be up there but to their point if she's the strong strongest player and she's the one with the best jewelry management it's, it's in their best interest to get rid of Candy, but I really want to see Candy win. And I would love to see Tamar win, but the, the jury, they hate Tamar because they just can't handle all that is Tamar. Oh, the came, oh, the Tamar. Like, Tamar is just too strong willed and just, she pops off too much. She's somebody that people, oh. you just have to take her or leave her, and a lot of people would just leave her. I like Tamar. I think she brought great entertainment to the season. And I just can't wait to see what the outcome is. So pop into the comments and hit the subscribe button and tell me what your thoughts are.